welcome back to another episode of Un... What, what am I saying? I've been playing Unhinged too much. Welcome back to another episode of Learning Unleash the Beast. Today, we are going to be doing some basic Tinker's Construct stuff. Um, I really should have gotten into this the first or second episode, but Darkcraft was intriguing. There's not much I can really do with it now, but there are a few things, one of which is going to be a Tips and Tricks episode, but I have all this stuff... There's no really need for me to do it specifically, but it's useful. So if you have exactly 52 of all of them, you get a perfect amount. So you don't really need to go searching for clay, which is really nice. And we are going to be creating the minimum smeltery, and then we're going to be smelting cobblestone. Yes, cobblestone. We also need aluminum brass, but instead of that, I think I'm just going to use gold, or maybe aluminum brass. I'm not sure. But if we go here, there's always a torch in there. I don't know why. Seared bricks. So we need to make this guy, this guy, this guy, one... Two. Did I just make two smelts? <sighs> Can I uncraft this? Of course I guess. Stupid freaking. Well, guess who's. You know Never mind. Y you'll see it in the tips and tricks video coming up pretty soon. So, let's just get clay. Let's get two stacks of clay. Gravel. This is going to be an extra. Uh, an exercised? No. A, I don't even know what I was going to say. Uh, organized episode, but now it isn't. I have so many resources, it doesn't even matter. Okay. We can smelt this up. I have two controllers. I guess I'm going to make <sighs> giant Never mind. Okay, uh, seared bricks. We need to make one drain, two drains. Should be enough for now. Make two basins. We'll make one casting table because we don't need the casting table much. Eh, we'll make two. And then we need uh, two tanks, so we get some glass. You you all probably know this already. I've gone tinkers pretty late. Two tanks, and then we just get the rest of them in bricks. Furnace is done. So once again, this is a very inefficient way of doing it, but eh, I'm rich. Okay, now, where can we find lava? Uh, we'll actually set this up at the other place, because this, again, is going to be temporary. And that bothers me for some reason. Even though the nether quarries have been going on for what seems like forever, they're not done yet. Just making the basic smeltery. Um, we'll actually put in two smeltery drains here. Or on the back, I guess. I'm not sure if those are directional dependent, just in case. Okay. And then the controller. We have another controller. We have uh, the tanks here and here. And then I guess we're just going to have a regular seared brick there. There we go. 
Well, I guess I can put the drains up a little more. That will probably work better, actually. And I believe if I step inside... Yeah. Oh, there's... Okay. Thankfully, I don't think this is the update where there's blood. No? Okay. So we're going to get these two blocks. There. There we go. We have a medium-sized... We forgot to make the drains. But we have a medium-sized thing. Uh, whatever you call that. <laughs> so organized today. Right. We need to make some faucets and some hoppers and a redstone clock. Of course, we also need a chest. Is there a chest anywhere? Okay. There we go. And now the redstone clock, which should be over there. And my amazing Vajra that can mine ice. That's very useful. I don't want to go through the portal. There we go. Now, a few things we have we can do that will actually benefit me. Um, we can make seared stone, seared pavers, and seared stone. Those are really nice blocks. And seared stone you just get from melting cobblestone. So I'm probably going to have one of these machines, like, big ones, non-stop, perhaps. Um, another thing we can also do is the knapsack and the heart canister. So I'm going to get those ready. I'm not going to stop recording because I am fairly short on time today. Um, let's see. What do we have here? Nothing of use. Do we have an ingot mold? No, we don't. I might want to keep that chisel. But... Stencil table. Let's make a new stencil. I remember hearing somewhere that you can just... Do I have sticks? I hope this will work. It does work. Okay. We need to make an ingot pattern. No, you can't make an ingot pattern. Oh my god. I just remembered that. Right, we need to get an ingot of some sort. We also need to get some gold. Or how do you make aluminum brass? Did I just... <laughs> ah. And casting tables. I can put this ingot in there. And I can get... What is aluminum brass made of? Aluminum brass. Copper, gold, iron... Aluminum brass. Are you kidding me? Okay, then what are the uses of aluminum? Aluminum? Why Why can't it just, like, tell me that? <laughs> aluminum and copper. Okay, I, I, I can get that. I have so much aluminum, it doesn't even... Aluminum. Um... Probably just need three. Aluminum. And copper. Okay. Actually, we need more aluminum for the the thing, but that doesn't matter really right now. We also need lava. I'm forgetting so many things. There's no lava in the nether anymore. It's all gone. Where are all my buckets? Buckets, buckets, buckets. 
So disorganized. Um, we have a bucket of force. That doesn't help. Oh, if you also notice this, I'm using Certus Quartz. I think that looks nicer than the iron blocks. It still has a border, but not as noticeable. And I've started moving my solar panels up there. I expected to hit that. Four buckets of lava, so that's two trips. That should be fine. And... There we go. The Vajra is amazing. If that bothers you, don't worry. I'm going to be nuking this place soon. One, two, three. <laughs> I've been putting in the same bucket of lava. There we go. Four buckets. That should be enough to melt it down for now, I guess. Melting down fairly quickly. Okay. So we have an ingot cast. And... <laughs> Stupid chicken. I have a headache. Oh, wow. That, that headache really, really hurts. Jeez. It's a light aggregator. Apparently something I can't make. Okay. What were we going for? Right. Heart canister. Knapsack. So, for the knapsack, we need some tough rods. And we're going to have to make a tough rod cast. So, okay. No, I don't want to... No! Are you kidding me? Did it just make two blank cast? Four blank casts. Can we melt this down? We better be able to melt this down. Okay, apparently we need an iron ingot. It's kind of crap. Apparently no matter where I take the iron ingot from, it's going to create some other recipe. Stupid miner. Where even is my miner's backpack? Where did my iron ingot go? I don't have a miner's backpack on this world. What? Did I put it in? I swear I took an iron ingot. Or maybe shift clicking it just brings it... Wow. Anyways. This guy back. Can't believe you can't use a regular iron ingot. <sighs> okay. And we need to find a tough rod. So I didn't make that blank pattern for nothing. Blank pattern. Or maybe I <sighs> for God's sake. Tough rod. Knife. Tough tool rod. Is it a tough tool rod or does it have to be a tough rod? Tough tool rod, okay. And then we. Ah, God damn it. We get some. Some wood. wood. There's my buckets! I had 10 freaking buckets. Well, that's ridiculous. What? Cobblestone it is. Of course it went to my cobblestone backpack, which I completely forgot that I had. I'm not sure why this tough rod isn't working. 
Material cost three. I did not see that. I thought material cost was only a thing. Only a thing in. In whatever it is. You know, that thing. Ugh. So terrible. No, we're. Where are my casts? Where's my ingot cast? Where? I swear this game. There we go. Ingot cast. Now what we have to do is we need to uh, dump out the rest of this. Okay. Put an ingot cast in there. And tough rod in there. We need two iron ones, right? Two iron tough rods. Material cost of three. I'm just going to smelt down buckets. Now, where were those buckets? That should be enough. Right? Don't jump inside that thing. It's just not going my way today. And we also need aluminum. We need... Ten of these, right? Which means we need twenty ores. Aluminum blocks actually look pretty nice too. I'm not sure how much aluminum I have if I can afford that. Eh, we might be able to. Oh. I hope my hard drive isn't getting full. 20 aluminum ore. If that finishes before the buckets, it shouldn't, right? Doesn't show how much fuel we have for some reason. Buckets are almost done. Okay, we have some iron that we can pour into there. We have some aluminum. We have some more aluminum to put in. And that's done. So now we should be able to just place down the redstone clock in this chest on top of this. Okay, it's working well. My fan is so loud. Like, if, if you were to hear this without the noise cancellation. Where is it? Knapsack. Golden leather. I have that. Somewhere. Leather and... Gold, jeez, the lag. 64, why do I have 64 blocks of gold? Gold, leather, and iron tough rods. A knapsack. There we go. It's one thing, Tinkers. Now I have an extra slot in which I can put my bags. And my old tools. And things I really don't need. Okay. I'll keep that. We are going to have to set up the witches very soon because, as you can see, my redstone is at an all-time low. Actually, it rose up a little bit, but we're, we're less than 20k. Far, far less than 20k. 
23 ingots. We are getting there. I should get the hearts and the bones. We need to get 10 hearts and 10 necrotic bones. And then 10 jeweled apples, which I believe I still have because I didn't finish eating them all. I hope. Oh, come on. And we had eight hoppers. I'm just so, so organized. Don't jump in there. Put that there. That's where a cobblestone is going to go in the future. We can probably just put a barrel. I'll pull it from the barrel eventually. These ingots cool fairly slowly. Right, jeweled apples, where are they? I kind of don't want to spend another 40 diamonds, but... Is it in my backpack? They are. Okay. That's convenient. Are we done? We are done, the aluminum ingots. Time to get 40 hearts. There. There. I really hope this is shapeless. It is shapeless. There we go. Shabam. Am I... Never mind that, because I was making a Tips and Tricks video. That is the reason. That is the reason. Now, let's get rid of these and get rid of these. We can put these in here. We're never going to use them again. But what we are going to do is we are going to place that there. We are going to get a heck of ton of cobble from our cobblestone backpack. And we're going to start making seared stone. Now seared stone is an amazing thing. Because it's a great building block. That's basically it. <laughs> But compressed cobblestone, compressed cobblestone, compressed cobblestone. Alright, that pulls out. Perfect. Okay. Get more cobblestone. This one cobblestone block will have so much cobblestone inside of it. Yes. More cobblestone than I had in total before. We're going to fill up that barrel. Probably more than fill up that barrel. Yeah, we're going to fill up that barrel. So I guess I'll dump them back on the ground. And... Okay. Go back into my cobblestone backpack. There we go. Perfect. As you can see here, this is on on its way to making seared stone. As you can see here right now, hopefully. Yeah, okay. You can see it over here. Seared stone is getting dumped in here. Then once it gets enough, Seared stone, makes a brick, and comes out there. Perfect. And we're going to make seared stone things and other things. Um, I'm going to expand that a little bit. And I think that's basically the episode. Uh, let me just finish getting some things. Seared bricks. Um, we would need... 
6 times 4, 24 bricks. Eh, that's pretty good. Close enough. I, I wasn't going to bother counting. I wonder how tall these can go. Bam. There we go. We have seared bricks being created. Um, we have now 20 hearts and a backpack. That's basically, like I said before many times in this episode, that's basically all we can do with Tinker's Construct. Now, tools aren't really worth it. Um, ladders aren't really worth it. Drawbridge maybe, but meh. Yeah, Tinker's is based on tools and I've got a Vajra. Can't really beat that. What would be the uses of a golden head? Apparently nothing. So, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you again next time.